Hi guys, so today we're going to be doing a quick unboxing of some Ninja Turtle statues. Um, you're getting your first look at my, hold on, uh, you're getting your first look at my new setup behind us here, my new Ninja Turtle display. I moved some stuff around. I'll do a room tour of that soon. Um, so let's check out Leonardo. So here's the front of the statue, side, back side and nothing on the bottom and just a turtle logo on the top pretty much same on all of these michelangelo back side donatello pretty much same product shots all the way around side view front view side view let me get these out of the box and we'll check them out okay so here they are all of them out of the package so we'll look at them here so let's do michelangelo first so these are very very lightweight um even though they're bigger than my good smile statues i would say these are probably lighter uh so starting on michelangelo we do have a real, let's do this here because that's going to keep focusing weird. So we do have a real chain. M on the belt. Some good shading. And then the base. Um, in case you guys are wondering where this artwork came from, this is actually from one of the scenes in the first cartoon, in the opening of the cartoon, the original cartoon, um, where they're all four standing on a building and it's kind of nighttime. And that's kind of where this artwork is from. Uh, got some real chain back here, some pretty sloppy paint there, um, more sloppy paint. Paint job on these things are not great, um, they're okay though, they look pretty good from a few feet away. Uh, and we got Raphael, his weapons don't seem like they come out. And he's got no place to storm. He just slides him into his belt, I guess. Uh, there's his face. Look at all that overspray. Donatello. He doesn't have a place to store his bow because that's solid, not hollow. Turtle butt. And then Leonardo, and he's the oddball because he has removable weapons. So we can attempt, let's put this guy out of the way here. Zoom out. That one does not feel like it wants to go in there. Let's see if it goes in better on this side. I guess that's where he's holding it. It's not going any farther. I think I could probably wedge that in there further. There we go. They're definitely not coming out, that's for sure. So... Let's check them all out. All four of them together here. And let's see. How would the bases line up? Do they line up? They don't line up anyway, do they? So I guess if you're going to be there. Nope. 
work, is it? Well, either way, that's not how they're going to get displayed anyway. So Raph is definitely the tallest out of them, and then Michelangelo, then Leonardo, and then Donatello. All right, I'm gonna get these in the detox, show you how they look. All right, so here we go. Let's see what they look like without the light here. So I put a light in the case here. Kind of see what they look like. Can't go any farther, guys. My cord's too short on this light. Um, so I put Donatello on a riser. And then just put a light in that detoff. So they all four do fit on one shelf in a detoff. Um, which is good because my plan was 